One of the reasons that I went into education was not because of the subject. I, am a, I have an English major and a Spanish minor, but I wasn't there because I loved English or I loved Spanish. But I really, truly loved the children that I was working with or the teens that I was working with, so I was there for them. What I enjoyed was being able to look at a student individually and say, how do we create a system that serves that student? And so um, when I was um, able to become principal at Delta High School at Cabrillo College, um, it was like being a kid in a candy shop because I could look at each student individually and say, what does this young person need? How can we help them have a positive and successful experience? So we provide work-based learning experiences for young people and a work-based learning experience can be anywhere between an informational interview, job site visit, job shadow, being able to um, do an internship. And for many young people, they go home. My children came home and if they said, oh mom, I think I want to be a lawyer, then we'd say, oh, well then you can spend the day with our friend. But Your Future is Our Business wants to provide that for every single student in our county. So whether they go to home to people with resources, maybe their family, um, maybe their parent didn't graduate from high school, maybe they work such long hours and they don't have the network and the resources. So we want to provide that for every student and what we're working on is to change the culture in our county. When a young person feels um, heard and seen and valued by their community, not only does it benefit the young person, it benefits the entire community. When you think about students in school, during the school year the majority of their day is spent with their peers and interacting with their peers. Many times they don't get an opportunity to have positive interaction with adults, so this benefits all students. When you look at those that might be exposed to violence or students that might have mental health issues, it's being able to be respected and valued and seen, and so I feel like it's not that I'm working on separate initiatives, it's that they're bringing them all together. It'll make me cry because I had the opportunity to work with just wonderful, wonderful people and I had the opportunity to see the beauty in so many children and to see that, see them grow and to flourish and to even be the littlest part of that becoming unlocked in them and growing. It's, when I think about a hero, I think about one specific act of just incredible hero heroism. I got to watch those little heroic acts every single day that a young person built confidence and courage and moved forward.